Hello everyone, Mark here with Mark's Max Muscle, and we are taking a look at Dr. Phil, Phil Heath, and Sean Roden. This is at the 2016 Mr. Olympia event. Now, as per usual, Phil did recapture his title, but one thing that was different here, Sean Roden placed second for the first time in his career. He figured that he was going to play second one year prior, but that was the year Dexter Jackson surprised everybody with his second place finish. So Sean Roden was not denied here. He did battle Phil Heath, and I remember the announcer. He did say this was Sean Roden's first time in the second place position, and Dennis James jumped on him, and he corrected him. And he said, no, Sean Roden placed second before. Well, I believe Dennis James. I believe you were wrong. But taking nothing away from Dennis James, I love that guy. I don't know why I did that. That was terrible. Anyway, he's one of my heroes is Dennis James. So I don't know why I went to do that. But either way, guys, how close was Sean Roden really to Phil Heath? To filthy Phil, Dr. Phil? Well, he did catch him two years after this, the 2018. So it's not... It's not out of the reach for Sean Roden to have defeated Phil Heath here. He is defeating him in the front double bye after all. Individualize the arms and Phil is probably winning the triceps biceps, but the forearms mostly gives an edge in the arm development, but pan back. There's no flow. There's no aesthetics and there's a big midsection for Phil. So definitely, in my opinion, Roden gets this first pose, and in the second pose as well, I would give this to Sean Roden. I never liked the pecs and the abs, and that is the center of the pose for Phil Heath in this shot, in this pose. And that basically is the thing that is hurting his front double by, is that midsection. Because on the lats alone, he may be even beating Sean Roden, believe it or not. I like Sean Roden. He's taller. He's not only taller, he's he stands taller as well, guys. So they might be close, 5'9", and then the other one 5'10", but still, Sean Roden, he doesn't crouch down like Phil Heath. So I size these guys the way I see fit. But anyway, side poses. Now, Sean was going to get an edge in the front, I believe, and Phil is definitely getting an edge in the side. Much bigger, thicker. I don't know why Sean Roden, or rather Phil Heath, gets bad press in this side chest pose. I think it's one of the best. It's among the best, for sure. Sean Roden, I've seen him drier. 2018, compare that one. Much drier, especially in the glutes. Either way, Sean losing both of the side poses hard to find dr phil hitting the side chest or side tricep rather in 2016 isn't that queer and by queer i mean weird strange don't want to get you guys going again but anyway let's look at the back developments and see how sean roden or cl how close sean roden really was to phil heath Come on, guys. There's no way. There's not even a inkling. And I believe Sean Roden said he was coming in. I'll do his voice here. I'm going to match Phil Heath pose for pose. I'm peeled this year. He takes pauses in between words, does Sean Roden. And I'm going to take the title. And then, of course, Phil Heath. And I, I'm not good at Phil Heath impressions, so bear with me. And then Phil Heath would say, You're not going to do nothing, man. I'm the champion, man, man. And I guess that's my Phil Heath. Take it for what it is, guys. Phil Heath is destroying Sean Roden here. For those of you who are blind or hard of sight, maybe Sean Roden would be winning. But look at the three-dimensional caves and canyons. Just unreal for Dr. Phil. Not to mention drier in the, in the hamstrings, too. Rear double bicep. Phil Heath leaning back. Nice, creating such a thickness in those lower lats. Although I do like the lower back for Sean Roden. He stands up nice and straight. Again, creating a several inches 
height difference between these two, which is correct, guys. He's leaning back, Phil. He's bending at the knees more. So you got to take everything into consideration when sizing these guys. I like this pose for Sean Roden. This is closer than the rear lat. Definitely not beating the doctor, though. Doctor, so dry in the glutes and hams. Unbeatable, guys. Dr. Phil, one of the best in this shot. Go to the ab and thigh. And aha. For those of you who thought that I was sizing these incorrectly, hey, I might even be giving Phil Heath some inches. He's bending at the knees, guys. That creates a lot. And he is an inch shorter anyway. It looks like he's about a foot shorter than Sean Roden here. And Sean definitely winning this one, guys. There's no argument. No ifs, ands, or buts. Go to the final pose in the most muscular. And this is where the doctor, he really gives the diagnosis of negative for his opponent here. Is that funny, doing doctor references? Or should I just, you know, ride under the radar calling him doctor? Anyway, enough of that foolishness. Let's go to another one because Sean Roden looked very small in that pose. Don't know if I got the sizes correctly or not. Now, I like this one for Roden. He should most certainly stay away from the crab and do this one. Look at his conditioning. Look close, guys. Look at that vascularity, thin skin. Well, he gave Doctor a good little fight. He definitely did. But it, when I seen the back shots, it was all over. Dr. Phil, Phil Heath, put a fork in this one. It's all over. Definitely captured the title in 2016, in my opinion. Now, I have, I've had several, quite a few requests to do this one. And it was quite a while ago, even up until recently. So that's why I decided to do this and chalk it up to another fan request. I didn't think that there was any controversy anyway I, this, this is one of phil heath's best versions but i mean two years later he did catch him so it was an interesting question how close was he and that's probably what i'll name this because i don't think it was a matchup phil heath diagnosis he is dr phil domination phd hope you guys enjoyed this comparison hit thumbs up if you did subscribe to the channel and go ahead and follow me on instagram as well have a great day